The Softing Gateway PN Gate PA slash PB enables the easy connection of Profibus PA NDP slaves to Profinet controllers. Up to 64 Profibus PA NDP slaves can be connected to almost any type of controller. Following, we will show you how to create a project with a TIA portal for the PN Gate PA slash PB. Start TIA portal and select Create new project. Enter a project name and a project path and click on Create. Select Configure Device and then Configure Networks. Open the hardware catalog and select the corresponding PLC. Drag and drop to insert it into Network View. Double click on the CP1516 Profinet Interface X1 to enter Device View. Navigate to Ethernet Addresses. Enter a valid IP address. Select Options, Manage General Station Description Files and import the device GSDML file. Open the hardware catalog and select the PN gate PA. Select the PN Gate PA and drag it into the network view. Assign the PN Gate PA to the CP1516. Double click on the PN Gate PA to enter Device View. Navigate to Profinet Interface X1 and select Ethernet Addresses. Enter a valid IP address reachable by the PLC. Deactivate Generate Profinet Device Name automatically. Under Real-Time Settings I.O. Cycle, you can set the Profinet cycle time. Note the address where the function lock in slot 1, subslot 2 is mapped. In the PLC programming view, open the default PLC tag table and create a variable of the type real. Enter the data type and the address. Compile the project and click on Download to Device. Select the proper interface type, PC interface, and the interface on the PLC which the PC is connected to. Click on Start Search. After the search has finished, select the CP1516 and click on Load. Go online with the PLC and verify that both the PLC and the PNGate PA slash BB are in data exchange. In the PLC programming view, open the default PLC tag table. Set the CPU to run and start monitoring the variable FBK underscore zero underscore one one six underscore input underscore data. Further information can be found on our website industrial.softing.com. Thank you for your attention.